Bao Shami is trying to develop the perfect water filter. She's constructing membranes made up of layers of graphene, 100,000 times thinner than a strand of human hair. We made it uh, from uh, graphite, which is a material that we use in pencils, for example. So it's, uh, it's cheap and relatively abundant. So we can use that, and the process that we use to uh, make from the graphite to the graphene oxide is actually quite scalable. By scalable, me means that these membranes could potentially be adapted to filter water from a household faucet, as well as large systems used to treat wastewater on an industrial scale. The membranes are much like a maze for water molecules. The water enters the maze and passes through a series of layers separated by spaces specifically designed to remove different types of contaminants. In order to kind of get a different, uh, remove different targeted molecules, um, the most direct way of thinking about it is to control the spaces, the spacing that we have between the layers. Another advantage to these graphene oxide filters is the rate at which water can pass through them, which Mi says is up to five magnitudes higher than conventional filters thanks to the unique properties of the carbon-based membranes. The researchers are currently fine-tuning their filters. They hope their work in the lab will ultimately lead to real-world solutions to the ever-growing concerns surrounding access to clean, affordable water, especially in the developing world.